This week on WTF, we are here at the gorgeous Mount Lavinia Hotel with a history and also a love story that comes along with it. 210 years of journey right here on WTF This Week. When you say 210 years, we're talking about a long history and of course the love story that holds this hotel together. Well, today we're going to take a look at the history that made this place so beautiful. From the tunnel where the love story is spoken about, to the room where they shared memories and of course the museum where they have held on to the stories that we would like to share with you. Did things. I don't need to tell you all this. You all know what happens in a tunnel. Yeah, what happens in a tunnel stays in the tunnel or in someone's tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> Well, one of the signature cocktails when you come here you should try is the Lavinia Sunset. It's one, it's beautifully shaded and it's a brilliant drink. But this is what I'm going to choose. Oh, wow. Well, I'm dining again at the governor's for lunch and what do you know, I'm not going for the buffet. I thought let's go through the a la carte menu. The choices are endless and if you are from the person who loves to enjoy a hot dog to a great fine dining meal, they have it all when it comes to a great a la carte menu. You're always spoiled for choice when it comes to dining at the Mount Lavinia Hotel. There's always a spectacular place. But when it comes to the nighttime where the breeze is heavy and you just want a perfect place to relax with your special someone, well, the Seafood Co. is the place. Here, it's also a fish market where you get a chance to choose what you like to personalize your dishes. So, the Sunday brunch is a huge spread at the Mount Lavinia Hotel and the dessert counter is the biggest spread. So I thought, we'll start with this and then go for the mains. It's a wrap on WTF. We'll see you soon. Do you think these rooms are haunted? Yeah. Really? <laughs>